Hello everybody. I hope you guys are enjoying um, these scary story kind of stuff for the 31 days of October. And if you are, please let me know by liking and subscribing, commenting, etc, etc. And I'm going to be reading whew, uh, off of my tablet here. I'm going to be reading a um, true scary reported news and this one is called the axe murder house so if you feel free to let me know in the comments below if what your guys's opinion on it and so on and i hope you guys are enjoying all of the these scary stuff I, I sure am, so hopefully you guys are, and if you guys are watching this, you probably more likely are. So, let's just get right into this, and this one is called, like I said, The Axe Murder House. The Vilica Axe Murder House in Vilica, Ohio, as well known, known notorious. Tori Trans transaction for ghost hunters and in horror lovers alike. The site of a gruesome unsolved 1912 murder in which six children and two adults had their skulls completely crushed by an axe as an unknown proprietor was purchased in 1994, restored to its 1912 condition, and con converted into the tourist's destination. It cost $428 a night to stay at the haunted house, where visitors always reported strange paranormal experiences such as vision Visions of a man with an axe roaming the halls or a faint scream of children. But November of 2014, hunting took darker in another darker turn. Robert Stevens Larson Jr., 37 of Wisconsin, was an on a uh, was a regular paranormal visit which with his friends when true horror strucks the Montgomery Montgomery uh, Sheriff's Department office said Larson suffered from self-inflected injuries at around almost one in the morning which was around the same time the 1912 acts murders in the house began. Larson recovered all from his injuries, but never spoken publicly. But what occurred that day? For Martha, Martha Lynn, the owner of the house, the accident was very upsetting. It's publicly, publicly, but it's not extremely the kind of public see you desire to have. I don't want people to think they will come they will come to the Villa Axe Murder House with something going to happen that's going to make them do something like that. The house remains open for to tourists visits and overnight stays stay to this day. Ooh, that was intense. Let me know what your guys' thoughts and whatnot. If you guys if you guys know any inf information besides that and want to share, feel free to say in the comments below. If you want to know more of these kind of um, important scary stuff, hit the subscribe button and hit the notification so you won't miss anymore and 
I just want to let you guys know that if you guys want that little extra income or want to have a better lifestyle, click the first link in the description below and start your income from home route or your little self-employment. Um, the steps are in the description below, but if you just want to be a, a um, customer and just get a few things to try out, click the loyal customer. It will be amazing, and I will see you in the next video. And don't forget to do that and subscribe and etc. And see you tomorrow's video. Bye!